Let's consider our most advanced computer, our brain. We all make decisions all the time, but we don't understand exactly how it works. I analyze functional magnetic resonance images to study one of the most common decisions we make, the decision to make a conscious movement. Our collaborators at the Methodist Hospital collect data of a subject who purposely squeezes a ball whenever he sees unpleasant images. By, uh, the data contains the brain activity in time of millions of neurons and how it changes during this decision process. By examining the activity in the brain, I can trace the location of the brain when it sees that visual stimulus to where it ends up in the motor cortex. By grouping neurons of similar uh, activation, I can find areas of similar brain activity or brain areas that interact. I use an artificial neural map, a kind of artificial brain to study the brain. That's right, I use an artificial brain to study the brain. By using this artificial brain, I can group neurons of similar activities and map the brain. This is my step towards making a better neural map of how the brain works and hopefully a step to explaining how conscious movement occurs. Thank you.